Today, let's talk about how you can customize your Google Home screen to look like this. By the end of this video, your Google Home screen is gonna look exactly like mine. Jumping right into step number one. First, go to the Google Chrome store. Search up Night Tab. This is a program that gives you a ton of customization features for Chrome. It's also got a perfect five-star review and over 100,000 downloads. Once it's downloaded, go ahead and open a new tab in Chrome. It's going to ask you if you wanna give Night Tab permissions. Go ahead and click OK. Now, step number two, we're gonna go through a ton of different settings. These are gonna be to tweak the homepage itself. And here we go. First, click this gear icon. Now click theme in the top left. Scroll down to style. Check dark mode. Now go to color. Set primary color to 190. Saturation to 50. Accent color to this. Copy these exact font settings. Corner radius to zero. Shadow size to 200. Shade opacity to 50. Shade blur to zero. Now under opacity, set everything to zero except for bookmark. Okay, that was a lot of settings. Now let's go ahead and set your background. If you wanna get my exact Hunter Hunter image, here's how you can do it. Open up Google and search Gon and Kilua suits. Click here. Now right click and press open image in a new tab. Then right click and press copy image address. But remember, you don't have to use my exact image. You can use any image you want. Feel free to deviate to whatever you like best. Now go back to the theme tab and under background, paste the URL that you just copied. Now under layout, check transparent. Under bookmark, check transparent. Set bookmark border to one and press the button add unique accent to each bookmark. Now on the left side, click layout and set global size to 100 and area width to 50. Scroll down and check align horizontal and header then bookmarks. Now click the header on the left and uncheck everything in this section except under clock and date. Copy these exact settings for both clock and date. It's especially important to check new line at the bottom. Now click bookmark and set it to these settings exactly and do the same with group. And finally do the same with toolbar as well. By the way, I have a ton of other videos on tech and customization. So be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss the next one. Okay, step number three, the final step. Let's make your buttons look awesome. Click the pencil icon in the bottom right. Press the X here and delete this second group. So the way we're gonna get this look is by putting all the icons in the same group. Now click the pencil edit button on an individual icon. Check display visual element. Now click the icon bullet and search for the icon you want to use. So in this case, YouTube. If there's no icon, just search a PNG image on Google. Now uncheck show name. Also click address and enter the URL. Now click theme and click custom accent. Pick whatever color you want for each tile. Now do the same process for each button and remember this one last thing. If you want extra wide or extra tall buttons, just go to layout, scroll all the way down and check the wide tile or tall tile and enjoy that new Google Chrome. It looks so clean. But don't stop here. Why not customize your desktop home screen as well? I just wrapped up a guide to get an insanely clean desktop home screen and it looks like this. Click the link in the description below to check it out. Or if you prefer, it'll pop up on the screen right now with some other recommendations. See you next time.